I just read uh, part 754, but I'm going to redo it. Because the Lord just kind of gently showed me something here, which is really kind of cool. See, 753, I didn't even realize this at the time I read 753, but I'm thankful for the Lord where he had me to stop. Um, notice this. In the second year of Darius the king, in the sixth month, in the first day of the month. Second year of Darius, sixth month. Okay, then we'll go to Haggai 2, and it says in the seventh month, the other one was sixth month, in the one and twentieth day, twenty-first day of the month, seventh month, then over here, okay, actually, I did read 754, and then I stopped here. Sorry, this is the one that I just read, and I'm going to do it over again. And I'm going to read from here, Zechariah 1, it says, the eighth month, the second year of Darius. So here we got Haggai and Zechariah simultaneous. But this one was in the seventh month, this one's in the eighth month. And now I'm going to read 755 up to... As I read it again, just down to here, because then it says in the 4 and 20th day of the ninth month. So now it's going to be the ninth month. Then over here we'll have some more from the same day. In the ninth month, 24th day. So I'll read all the way over to this portion of Zechariah 1, where it'll then go on the 4 and 20th day of the 11th month, the 24th day of the 11th month. See, this was the 24th day of the ninth month so interesting that's how i will divide the readings for the next uh, section here it's just interesting it's interesting you can make your own chronological bible with words of the lord and check them too as we go along make sure it doesn't all of a sudden skip back or something there's one part here that is kind of curious see it goes from zechariah 1 and it goes here and then it continues on with Zechariah 4. So what goes on between Zechariah 1.17, you know, and then chapter 2 and chapter 3, and then the beginning of chapter 4, up until this? Be interesting to look into. See what you find. <laughs>